We at the car wash, baby. No, we're not. We're in my home. I'm your host, Jesse Sawyer. Now she recognized inclusive fitness trainer, silver sneaker flex instructor. You can find out more about me. Visit my website at www.jessieswear.com. And if you've already subscribed, then you've already come across my one video, the wrist extensor stretch. Well, if you have an extensor, you gotta have a flexor. And I'm not talking about flexing those biceps. I'm talking about the wrist flexor stretch. Because what we don't want to happen is if we fall, we want to be able to stabilize ourselves. We want to be able to maintain strength through that fall. We want to be pliable as well. So we want to be able to extend and we also want to be able to flex. And here's a simple exercise for those instructors to add to your silver sneaker classes or for those seniors or older adults if you're worried about falling or even if you're worried about your pickleball game, this is a great exercise for you to do. Or if you fish or golf or throw ball with anything, a great exercise to help minimize osteoporosis or osteopenia and then also help with recovery of carpal tunnel as well. Great exercise. Here you go. Palm goes out, hand goes out, and you're just going to pop up like you're stopping a train or stopping a bus. And now you're going to grab those fingers and you're going to just gently and slowly pull those fingers back until you feel that stretch. Now you're going to feel that stretch more on the underneath where if you do that extensor, you're going to feel that more on the top. Whatever you do to that right side, you want to do to that left side. So I'm going to just put that hand out. There you go. Bam, bam, bam. Wiggle that waist. You don't have to wiggle that waist, but you want to have that hand. Left hand's out, right hand grabs those fingers and you're trying to keep that wrist nice and stable and pull straight on back until you feel that stretch. Again, you're going to feel that stretch on the underneath side of that wrist. How many times you do it, it's entirely up to you. But I would suggest you subscribe so you can get the wrist extensor stretch and then with this, you got the wrist flexor stretch. Add both of those to your classes Add both of those to your routine and watch your game or your falling ability go to the next level. Peace, my friends.